Greetings and salutations, and welcome back to the channel. As par the usual, I am Gabel S. Gabel. Greetings and salutations, and welcome back. As you see, we are jumping back into uh, Mech Warrior 5, and we've gotten a lot of work done. We have literally uh, almost the entire Rolodex of mechs in play now. Of the 367 that are in game, I own 343 of them. Uh, we maxed out our mythical uh, rank. We also maxed out our rival intel, and we've also very well overdone our arena fame. Uh, among other things, we have we have our pilots still. We have a whole new bunch of mechs to play with. Um, decent amount of equipment. Uh, right, right now we're in the Rasselhaag uh, air tory because there are three or four Q, uh, um, few mechs specific uh, to the Rasselhaag area and that we need to acquisition to have every um, mech in the game. That's our objective. Uh, we've also um, we are th uh, year. We are in year three thousand one hundred seventy nine. Year uh, year three thousand one hundred seventy nine, which is relatively one hundred seventy nine years past uh, when the game started. And as you are going to see, after I go to the save file, we are literally at sixty thousand fifty three days. Elapsed since I started playing, which equals out to I want to say about 130, 140 years. Uh, I could be wrong, but I'll, I'll do the math on that later at a later date. But uh, you didn't come here to me ramble. Uh, so without further ado, if you are enjoying the content, please give it a like, and um, if you're enjoying the content, please subscribe. Uh, we just finally got some upgrades to some of our equipment, so that's going to be kind of cool to see that will come into play. But without further ado, uh, let's get some, uh, let's do a 2v2 heavy. Uh, we don't really need uh, sea bills because as you can also tell, we are at 1.1,571,000,000 1 sea bills. So we really don't need money or salvage, but since it is a heavy, we are going to... Um, Probably get a higher than normal um, uh, salvage points just so we have the potential of getting them. And yet, yeah, we have also, um, let's see here, we need it's 2v2 heavy, so we have to downgrade our mechs to heavies. But as you will see, our inventory is quite large now. Uh, we have seven. Uh, we're so far we have act, we have active in our in our uh, launch bays uh, seven lights, seven mediums, and eight heavies, as well as a shitload. Let's see, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen assaults, because we've really been more doing the. Uh, heavy, uh, we've done a lot more of the assault stuff, so I'm going to go to uh, Catapult K2, which I've kind of switched over since my Cataphract, because normally uh, a Cataphract has been good, but I find uh, some of the newer stuff, this one is just wreaking more havoc on the battlefield. So we're going to uh, be taking that in a little more easier, plus it's a little easier on ammunition, and a wide variety, a lot better armament uh, compared to running out of bullets and then running around, so we'll do a quick, actually we won't do a save, we'll just, uh, we got Raptor, we're in the process of getting, um, I won't let me switch, oh it's probably stuck, which has happened, uh, the multi, uh, the co-op has been having issues, so I can't get anybody else to come in and still function for some reason either it could be a DLC thing or so it could be something co-op Xbox wise but we're not sure what yet but without further ado let's get back into it 
We even play a lot of the software worlds. And we got, oh, we got actually a pretty there. Uh, we can't see shit, so we'll switch over to night vision. And we're going to quickly probably dispatch these two. Uh, let's see, we have bonuses to doing damage, arms quickly, headshot, and components. So we'll see, um, let's see, we got destroy arms quickly, so we'll target an arm. And just like that, uh, we might have an arm gone. Yeah, arm's gone. Hey, you gotta watch our heat a little bit. But as you can see, we are literally just tearing apart majority of uh, the mechs that are uh, we, that we come into play now. Now we only have to get a headshot off this one. So we'll have him attack. And we're going to just go try to go straight for a head. Uh, we're hitting... We're not hitting head like we're supposed to. Or we don't need to, but we're doing more core damage than we need head right now. So, okay. So I have his head almost blown off. He's taking core thing. We need to get one shot off his head. Dead. Oh, we missed the head. Damn it. We took the torso instead. Damn. Thought we would have got it done. But, oh well. Shots landed in the right place, but it hit uh, other parts. So, as quickly as we started, we finished. At least we got three of the four bonuses. It's nice to get them all, but we don't really don't need to. But, but yeah, I also start put as some of you saw. I start posting short comment, uh, short um, clips because it's either give that a try. It's probably running the wrong formats on uh, YouTube, but just get a little more variety out there, put a couple more videos out there because there's a lot of moments that have appeared in game. And now that I've learned that I can record those while they're happening or go back and record it, then it makes getting clips like that a hell of a lot easier. So with that said, we got 3 million C-bills. We got another max rank. Uh, let's see here. We got quick draw. We got, 18, we got 21. We got medium lasers, uh, jump jets. Uh, we'll take... The quick draw, and most of the time, we're any mechs that we're gonna get, we're just going to sell because we don't really need them at this point. Because we're way above where we're supposed to be. So, but yeah, uh, he took no damage. The Marauder took no damage. I only took the most damage, which is fine because I was kind of up there, and he still did some damage, and he got one kill. So. Mm, let's see what we got. We got 16 million C bills, 16.1 million C bills, a Crusader SA2, a low, a large chemical lasers times four max tier, medium pulse laser max tier, medium mace max tier, large laser short burst max tier, and SRM4 stream max tier. Not a bad day at the office. Uh, let's see here. I believe we have. Let's get the our. Let's get our guys repaired. And the Crusader SA2. 113 firepower. Interesting. Oh, he's a looks like a laser variant. That's interesting. Let's see here. Oh, damn. Yeah, dual he's a yeah, he is a laser laser variant, alright. SRM 4s lasers for galore, but. That's too many lasers in one arm, in my opinion. Oh, let's see. Do we have any Crusader SA2s? We do have a Crusader there, so we don't need him anymore. So we'll sell a quick draw, and we'll sell that one. Two million off that one. 
for damage, and this one should be three or four. Huh? We got 4.4. Nice day at the office. So up next, we're uh, while we're here, let's see here, let's uh, go back over to contracts. Uh, we got a team combat open. So open means any weight class. We have 400 tons to play with. So we'll bring up a, we're going to go heavy because we're going to use our Mauler Lance because that is just vile as of right now in the last uh, little bit here. And it's been funny because it's just not fair to a point because there's a lot of ammunition going down and a lot of damage going down range. So I'll go with the R1. We'll give Raptor the... Uh, we'll give him KO. No, we'll give him... Yeah, we'll give uh, Carpenter... Uh, we'll give him the... Give her that. I'm not sure him and her, but... We'll give Carpenter the 2P, and then we'll take uh, the last one, that will be the secondary 1R. So yeah, this just is a very brutal lance right now. We'll do a quick save. <clears throat> and more than likely, we're going to either have, uh, I'll have 12 to 16 mechs that we're going to have to destroy. So we'll do a quick save. So we're at 60,059 days. Do a quick resume, we'll deploy, and then we'll bring the rain. Well, yeah, we had some more interesting videos coming up there. We just, uh, fi uh, we had a problem with the PS1. Uh, the cord actually died, so we went straight black and white. So we got a new there, now instead of running off the cordage, we actually have HDMI hookups. So let's see, we're going to get thrown right in the mix real quick. Yep, they're right on top of us. Oh shit, they're coming quick. We got two. We got one on the inside of us. I'm going to try and drop this Phoenix real quick. I can't see where he's at. Oh shit, we got a second team moving in on us. Try and drop this shadow and we'll try to reorganize because we got enemies coming right in on top. On the Crusaders, so they're gonna light us up with missiles. All right, that's one down. We got a Highlander in the mix. He's dropped. We still gotta get that one loose guy. Ow, that hurt, you little shit. Yeah, I lost an arm because I fucking cut crosses with the one guy. So I lost one of my medium lasers. As soon as I turn around, we'll eliminate that guy. Phoenix Hawk is still there. Phoenix Hawk's down. Alright. So we'll take a brief moment, search over what we got. Nope, we got one guy right on top of us. Get everybody attacking that guy. That's a hatchet man. Alright, we got only four mechs left. I've done the one that's taking the most damage right now. Everybody else looks pretty solid. And that first pass, we should have been fine, but I lost an arm, so it's going to suck a wee little bit. 
but we'll carry on. Uh, I still got, I only, like I said, I only lost my um, lower arm and uh, laser. Which is kind of how I designed these ones to be all just torso weapons and just fire away. When it, came, when it crossed our path is when we problem because that Highlander snuck up behind us and just lopped off my arm. Which is a problem. Let's see what we got. We got a Banshee, a Vindicator, a Trebuchet, and a Griffin. All solid. And they're both. We can get them out early. There. So hopefully we don't take much more damage. Uh, we got missile volleys, so we can literally just sit there and launch uh, missiles all day. Let's see, where are they hiding at? I don't think I can... Yeah, there's too much traffic. Or too much environment in that way. So we'll try and bait them in. Over here, so make him come up to that choke point. Let's see if we can. Yeah, uh, we can get. Uh, we can get eyes on them. So. So we'll launch a couple volleys and see if we can get them to uh, aggro us. We'll, I'll get the lance to move over there. Because they're going to come up through that choke point more than likely. Nope, they came in behind us. Alright, Trebuchet stays down, we got the one guy behind us, uh, I guess they dropped the guy, so we have the Banshee coming up. Nope, he's still there. Get out of the way! That's the Vindy. All right, Vindy's down. Get everybody attacking that guy. We'll come around. Ouch. All right, we got one guy left. We'll go over the hill and just start shooting up, taking him out. So we should be able to just give missile volleys in on this guy. Okay, so they're going to engage. He's coming up the choke path, so we're going to go up top of the hill or attempt to. We'll just go back down because they're all coming this way, anyways. And he's down as well. Another successful volley. Well, we'll still probably take a million damage due to the fact that I lost an arm, but again, it, I designed majority of the mechs to be able to lose main, one main component and still be fine because majority of his weapons guy got to go through three different parts to break off. And like I said, it was a lucky shot too because it was a melee weapon that came in and did that damage. Like I said, I probably lost an arm. I probably took a million damage, or a million worth sea bills destroyed. 
but oh, we only took seven hundred seventy-two thousand. But we'll claim one of the mechs, and that will. Uh, let's see, is there any other items that we are more interested in? Nope, just jump jets, small lasers. So we'll just take the mechs and run. Eighteen and a three for. Uh, we'll take uh, LRM five jump jets and make five million dollars. So all in all, make seven. Everybody took some damage, but they also threw a decent amount of damage as well. I took the most, but that's usually what happens when I'm in front of the line. But took took out, took out eight men and did fifteen hundred damage. And we'll get my guy repaired. Oh, I lost a double heat sink too. Double and a heat. Uh, uh, two doubles and a uh, single and a, me, a max tier or a, a tier four or medium laser. I don't like having ammo on the feet, but it is what it is. So we'll get him repaired. And it'll be 32 days, but we have several other ones that we're going to probably jump to because that was the end of that, uh, end of that bit. So, we'll probably head over to this arena first. And get him back repaired. He's down for 32, but each if each jump is going to be a base 13 days. So. so we got a bunch of equipment here. Let's see any mechs that peak and interest. 3V, an Assassin 21, and a Locust 3V. We have those already. Okay, let's quick take a quick peek at what they have for equipment. LRM 10. Yeah, we'll take that. LRM 5, we'll take that. Yeah, because most of the time we've been take uh, we, uh, we're at that point in the game where we can essentially sell all our zero tiers, tier ones, and tier twos. SRM 6, we'll take that. Let's see if we have any heat sinks or double heat sinks we can buy, because even though we have a shit ton left, no, it doesn't look like anything in there. So, the missions that we have, let's see, we got seven minutes left. Medium duel. We can probably do that in six minutes. So you guys get three bits of three battles in here. It's a medium. It's a it's a medium duel. So it's uh, medium tech. So we'll uh, we'll probably just take money because there's not really many mediums that we need at the moment. So we'll adjust. Because mediums are essentially just a 1v1. So that's got 19 days on it. We'll go to our mediums and let's see. We have the hatchet man. We'll bring our crab ballistic guy. So we got 85 days before our next uh, amount is due. And it's a difficulty medium too, so it's probably going to be a Shadowhawk or a heavy hitter weapon wise. So uh, we will do a ready. Do a quick save. And we'll get on with the video. Launch, well, and like I said, we have five minutes left, so that should be plenty enough time to finish this duel. Which is very interesting as part of the Solaris 7 uh, Showdown uh, DLC.
gives you a lot of arena stuff that gives you lots of money and lots of equipment. So let's see here, we have, it's going to be a Vulcan. We have uh, Entertain the Crown abilities, do ballistics damage, which we were, were designed for. Uh, melee damage, uh, destroy, we need to destroy an arm and deal damage quickly. So. so we'll do ballistics. Melee might be questionable, but we do have, I think, a couple hammer fists available. So He's an SRAM 4 medium laser and he's got a light rifle. Yeah, we uh, adjusted to where he's got uh, the Ultra A5s. His armors are internal. We got that arm off. We got to do 50 more uh, melee damage. You got to slow his ass down so I can get the melee shots off. I'm out, just out of his window. We got him. He exploded, so we punched him. To, we punched him to death, so that works out. <laughs> I did have the AC twos in there for quick damage and stuff like that, but. Uh, just with multiple people, uh, the more shots with the air, because one round will do um, 30 damage. So it literally can take peel off armor and a short burst. So that's why I switch over to the Ultra A5s. We got 4.7 million out of that. Uh, we upgraded our rank in the game. Uh, we didn't get much because, well, he exploded. But yeah, we only missed we missed melee damage by uh, 20 points, which is fine. Like, really didn't get anything to blame. Whether we got base payout, that will take fixed majority of the problems. So that was quick and painless. So we'll go repair him. And we'll figure out where our next we'll move will take us. Contracts, we have a free-for-all medium. Uh, we might do that one next, or we might just go somewhere else. But I thank you all again for coming out to the channel. And if you could give us a like, you could subscribe, and stick around for more content. Because like I said, we got a bunch of other stuff coming. And until next time, this is Kyobel S. Cobble saying have a good night and we shall see you in the next one.